It's gonna be very bad for Hutuna. I probably should have gotten her out of here. But oh, trust issues, man. Trust issues. It's wonderful. I love it. I'm sorry, Hutuna. The ball shook three times. You should have stayed in. But it's my luck today. Nidosaur is super close to leveling up, by the way. Uh, I did forget about that. Not gonna lie. Stay in the ball. Trust issues. Dude, seriously? I'm gonna waste all my Pokeballs on a Spiro. 100%. Waste all my Pokeballs on a Spiro. Why, why even bother? If it doesn't stay in the ball this time... <sighs> That's it, Spiro. You asked for it. Hello Pokemon Trainers, my name is AJ AK Arctic and welcome back to the channel. Now I'm sorry about uh, the first video on this game having no audio. It was because I was wearing the, the headphones and the audio was coming through there and I forgot to change it on my recording software so it wasn't it was going through the speakers which were not on because all the audio was coming through the headset and um yeah, uh, that was my fault, um, but I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode of Pokemon Infinite Fusion. I am actually enjoying this game so far, and uh, I'm putting um, Electrum 2 on the bag burner for right now so I can figure out Barbara's Gym. Oh, um, I'm ready to play another episode of Pokemon Infinite Fusion. I hope you guys are ready too. If you are, then leave a like. Uh, subscribe for more Pokemon content. I'm going to be uploading a lot more in the next few weeks you know it, it a lot more content is coming to this channel more than what is already coming and what has come um but yeah i hope you guys are ready for that and uh let's just jump right into this all right so in the last episode we tried taking on um a brock i did a little off-screen training poodle is ready to evolve he wanted to or she wanted to evolve uh, while I was training, I stopped it because I I wanted to show it on screen. But um, yeah, I'll throw the little training video right here. If you guys want to skip it, go right ahead. You guys don't have to watch it if you don't want to. It's fine. I
I just figured I'd throw it right there, but yeah. Boodle is now level 7, Ratgeet is level 9, and Bulbasaur is level 11. Um, I was training up mostly Hoodle, obviously, but uh, yeah, we're just going to jump right into this and take on Brock again because um, Raggy, I think, knows Gust now, which comes in handy. Uh, yeah, Raggy knows Gust now, so yeah, Hoodle knows um, Poison Sting, String Shot, Tackle, and Hypnosis. I think it learned Hypnosis while I was uh, training it. Uh, I'm not sure why I gave it Hypnosis, but... <laughs> whatever i think it's but I, I don't remember i think it had foresight but bulbasaur hasn't learned any new moves yet obviously still got leech sea growl tackle and vine whip but we are good to go i'm gonna start off with bulbasaur obviously to take on that uh geo geo -G? i think that's what it was but yeah come on brock let's do this again i am so ready for this we are so ready. Um, that That's probably a lie, but Bulbasaur, you're starting off first, and obviously we're bringing Ratgy because now that Ratgy has um, Gust, we should be good to take on that Dignix. And then, yeah, Dignix, yeah. So we got a Geogi right now. Come on. Come on, Bulbasaur. We got this. We got this, buddy. We can do this. All right, we're going to... Did I just hit Tackle? No, I wanted to go Leech Seed. What? Okay, okay. We mi They missed the Rock Tomb, which is good. Which is good. We're going to hit the Leech Seed. And we don't get it. That's cool. But that's that's wonderful. Can we, can we... Can we get the Leech Seed? Please? Oh, no, no. Come on, man. This is not... Off to a great start already. Off to a great start. All right, whatever. We're just going to hit the Vine Whip. Oh, no. Come on, Bulbasaur. Come on. Thank you. That did nothing. Um, okay. Can I get the leech seed off? <laughs> That'd be great. That'd be great. Please. Dude, why can't I get the leech seed? Okay, well, we're already off to a great start, guys. Already off to a great start. And got a crit. That's... Yeah, I wasn't ready for this. That's great. <laughs> Wonderful. Perfect. I'm sorry, Bulbasaur. I'm so sorry. I thought we were ready. I honestly thought we were ready. Damn. Okay. Uh, Yogi missed the attack, but I'm gonna hit... That did nothing. That did nothing. This is great. This is fantastic. Well... So much for that. Um, yeah. Great start. Perfect. Alright. Um, so, that didn't go the way I planned it. At all. Which is wonderful. Love it. Alright, so. I want to test something out real quick before we take on Brock. Can I go over this way? I can? Oh! Sweet! I want to see what I can find real quick, you know. I love the fact that my character just stops when uh, a battle starts, well, even when I'm running. It's funny. Alright, let's see if I can catch this thing. And I want to try to get Poodle up, level, up one more level so I can have it evolve. She definitely wants to evolve, so... Okay, Nidoran, I, I'm gonna need you to do do me a favor and go to sleep. <laughs> Just go to sleep. Take a nap. Take a little nap. Ah, uh, I missed. Ha, let's try that again. Take a little nap, please. Take a little nap. Dude, why am I missing my attack? What is going on? Whatever, get in the ball. Since you know you don't want to take a nap apparently i can't hit my attacks we got the nidoran oh, great all right <laughs> now i'm gonna i'm gonna battle these trainers that are over here just to see actually i'm gonna heal up real quick all right so that was new uh, <laughs> um yeah i walked back over into uh pewter and yeah the 
There was you you couldn't see the you couldn't see the town. I wonder if it'll I wonder if it'll happen again. Hang on. No? Won't happen again? Oh, okay. Well, I guess it doesn't want to happen again. Um, that was kind of weird. Are we going to have a... Okay, never mind. We're not going to have a double battle. Because, you know, double battles weren't a thing in this, uh... This, th this th Whatever. This generation. Got the black and white graphics, but we're only in the first gen, so... Um... I just realized what I was facing. A uh, Meowdle. Okay. That is cute, but weird at the same time. Not gonna lie. Straight up cute and weird. Alright, uh, Ratki, you're up. I want to try to get Poodle some more EXP, you know? Um, thanks for the growl. It's great. Fantastic. Not party. Um, yes. I wonder if Nidoran's gonna come in handy for Brock. I gotta check Nidoran and see. That did nothing. That did absolutely nothing. So, I'm pretty sure it's got more Meowth than Weedle because Racky is a flying type, which should have hurt we uh, Meowdle. Racky, come on, hang on. Ooh, hanging on at one, getting you out of there, buddy. I'm getting you out of here. Don't worry. Ooh, almost lost my raggy. That would have sucked. That would have sucked. All right, Bulbasaur, it's your turn. Let's just a vine whip this thing out of existence. Just whoops, you know. That did nothing. Wow. Okay. Um, one more. One more should do it. Now this thing is hurting me, and they got the flinch, which is. Fantastic. Um, yeah, great. <laughs> Damn, what? It didn't take it out? Why? Come on, man. Dude, this is a great battle. We're all right. Dude, this episode is going to be great, you know? Bulbasaur is level 12 and not learning a new move. All right, can, okay, I thought that guy was going to, was going to, like, want to battle me right then and there that would have sucked but uh yeah all right good to go let's go battle that one dude that i was staring at or looking at before uh i battled the other girl hey oh i like shorts they're comfy and easy to wear yo say i like shorts too i'm actually wearing a pair right now athletic shorts but you know I like them jean shorts and the uh, the, the cargo shorts, you know? They're, they're awesome. This is... What the hell are you? You are ugly. Ow. Great hit. Critical hit. Sweet. Let's get Hoodle out of there before we lose her. She is so close to leveling up and I can't afford to lose her. So... Yeah, definitely would have lost her. Ow, that hurt my Bulbasaur. Um, get the Leech Seed. Can we get the Leech Seed, or are we going to miss? Oh, we got it! Look at that! We finally hit a Leech Seed. That is awesome. Now, if only I could have done that against Brock, you know? Would have been great. We would have been fine. But no, it had to avoid the attack, and that did nothing. Okay. Um, I gotta find something to, I wonder, I wonder what would happen if I placed Bulbasaur with Nidoran. Oh, oh, that's probably, I, I think that's a good idea, because I think, isn't Nidoran a poison type? Bulbasaur is a grass, that would give Bulbasaur a grass and poison typing. Unless, I think Bulbasaur is already grass and poison, I'm not quite sure. Poodle is now level 8 and ready to evolve. I lost my comfy feeling. No, oh, that's, that's sad. And Hoodle should, yep, there it goes. Hoodle is evolving. Let's see what we get. This is gonna be weird. What do we got? Oh, 
<laughs> uh, yeah, like I said, weird. We got a hoot tuna. Hoot tuna. Yep. That is awesome. Um, let me check on my hoot tuna. Because that should be a... It's a flying and poison type. Sweet. All right, Bulbasaur, you are... Okay, so you are grass and poison. And then Nidoran is just a poison type. So, here's the thing. I want to see what... Ooh. Ooh, that burp came out of nowhere. I want to see what happens when I splice Bulbasaur and Nidoran. Oh my god. Just look at that outline. I'm doing it. Let's see what we get. I'm sorry, Bulbasaur. I love you, but I just want to see. If anything, I'll just unsplice them, you know? <laughs> what the? A Nidosaur. You know what? I'm keeping it. It's weird. I like weird. Oh. The male Nidorine has developed muscles that freely move its ears in any direction. There's a seed on its back. Dude. Choose an ability. Uh, Overgrow. I'm trying to learn Leer. No. Yes. Not learn Leer. We le Ooh, we're learning Peck? Ooh, that'll come in handy. Let's get rid of Growl for that one. Alright, so... That is... So cool. I love it. Alright, I'm gonna heal up one more time, and then we're gonna try taking on Brock again. Alright, we're healed up. Ready to take on Brock. I hope. Now that we have... Uh... Nidos... Nidosaur... We got Hutuna and Nidosaur who are, should be good for this battle. I'm probably gonna try to use Hutuna as well. So let's try, let's give that one a try. We're gonna use Hutuna and Nidosaur. So bring it on, Brock. I've got a new Pokemon for you to see. All right, Hutuna, uh, I'm gonna start off with you. And then we're gonna work our way into Nido. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. That's, yeah, that's my luck. It's just my luck, man. Alright. Hutuna? Nidosaur. Confirmed. Jesus. Ready. Alright, Brock. Let's do this. Hi, Geogi. Meet Hutuna. A new friend of mine. Alright, uh, let's start off with the hypnosis. See if we can, uh... Is that gonna hurt? I miss. I can't hit the. Why can't I hit my attacks? Like that's the pro, that that's the problem. Like they can hit their attacks, but I can't hit mine. Why can't I hit my attack? Like why is hypnosis missing? Dude. Well, so much for this battle. This is um. This is great. Can't hit my attacks for some reason, but you know. Oh, Nidosaur is only level ten now. I lost two levels. That's unfortunate. Oh, I got my leech seed. Hell yeah. Okay, so Gust still is super effective. Which is... Makes sense. You know, makes sense. Um, let's try a peck. See what that does. Nothing. It does absolutely nothing. <clears throat> makes sense. I should have started with Squirtle. But, I mean... Bulbasaur should be helpful here, but because of the the typings that you can get with splicing Yeah, that that's the that's the bad part It's just trying to make trying to keep up with the typings that they, they have, you know We're not gonna win. We are Oh Nidosaur living on one HP a needle sore. Do I have a potion though? Doubtful. Oh, I do. I also have a fresh water. I'm gonna give that to needle sore. And it's going for rage. Okay. That does nothing, which is good. Leech seed. And bind. I'm fine with that. I'm fine. You squeeze me. We're just gonna we're just gonna do that. And then I'm gonna get squeezed by Bind. Yep. Okay. And then Vine Whip. We should be able to do this now. How are you faster? 
Oh, because Rock Tomb just destroys my speed. That's why. Okay. Um. I I think I'm gonna use my potion here because it's gonna go for another Rock Tomb. I I have a feeling it's gonna do another Rock Tomb. Ready? Oh, it's gonna go for Bind again. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. We we can pull this off. Come on, Needle Sword. We can pull this off. You and me. Here's the rage. Does nothing. Finish it. Finally, we take out the Dignix. Oh man. And Needle Sword is now level 11. Level oh so close, so close to level 12. All right. As proof of your victory, here's the Boulder Patch. Thanks, Brock. I also want to give you this. We got Rock Tomb. Hell yeah. This TM contains the move Rock Tomb. It's a rock type move that will slow the opponent down. There are all kinds of trainers in this world. You appear to be very gifted as a Pokemon trainer. Go to the gym in Cerulean and test your abilities. On it. Wow, you're even hotter. Uh, thanks. Cool. <laughs> I was not expecting that, but you know, that. Yeah. Sweet. All right. One more time. Alright, time to move on to Cerulean City. Luckily, I've already taken out... Arctic! Uh, hey. It's me, Professor Oak's assistant. I was doing some field work around here and I came across something incredible. You really gotta see this. Seems like there's an outbreak of wild Pokemon with hidden abilities on this route. I saw one of them in this very patch of grass. You can tell when a route has a hidden ability outbreak by the way the wild Pokemon sparkle in battles. This is a very rare event. We're lucky to be witnessing it so close to home. But I don't expect to last for very long, for a very long time either. So you should try to catch one of these rare Pokemon while you still have a chance. While I'm headed, well, I'm headed to Cerulean City for some field work, so I better get going. It's right on the other side of Mount Moon. Maybe I'll catch you there. Oh, yep, cool. Maybe I'll catch you there. Good luck with your Pokemon League challenge. Thanks. So they said that there are. Pokemon with hidden abilities here. Uh, definitely not this Nidoran, that's for sure. Um, run, can't escape, that's cool. Run, don't tell me I can't escape again. Run, got away. Sweet. Alright, so let's try it again. Sparkle? Oh look, it's a, a female Nidoran. You know what? Might as well catch you. Why not, right? Oh, of course, it's faster. Makes sense. That did nothing. Alright, um... Maybe I can get a hypnosis off? Maybe? Probably gonna miss? Dude, I don't even know why I have hypnosis if it's just gonna continuously miss. It, make, it makes no sense to have a move that's just gonna continuously miss. I don't know what my luck is today, but apparently it's not good. And I am not loving it at all. I'm actually a little frustrated. I'm not, not really. I'm not frustrated at all. I'm having a great day. This game's just, uh, it just likes to make me miss my, my attack, you know? And I don't get it. Can you stop tail whipping me? That'd be great. Hey, I got my hypnosis off. About time. All right. Time to throw a Pokeball at it. Get in the ball. Yes. Yes. Maybe. Got it. Perfect. I'm gonna start turning my hat around like Ash does every time I throw a Pokeball, you know? Give it a, a, a nickname? No. Alright, so we got a Nidoran. What else can we find here? Another. Oh, look, it's got a hidden ability. Okay, so. I guess I should catch you, huh? I guess. I, I mean, I could always fuse it with another Pokemon later down the line. Don't know what I would fuse it with, but why not? May hey, I wonder what would happen if I fused purple and blue Nidoran. Male and a female. That'd be, uh, I feel like that would be a little weird. Although funny at the same time. Alright, so it is weak. Let's throw a Pokeball at it. Getting the ball. Yes. Sweet. Got it. 
I got a hidden ability, so I gotta see what um what hidden ability you have. All right, so let's see what we got. Um, wait, come on, thank you. Where is your ability? Oh, it's got hustle, boost the attack stat, but lowers accuracy. Oof. All right, so I do I have any DNA? I have one more DNA splicer. What happens if? Okay, I'm not doing that. Nope. Alright. <laughs> Let's see what else I can find. Is it just Nidoran's? Oh, look, a Spearow. Alright. Another Pokemon to add to my, uh... Weirdness collection, you know? Because I'm going to fuse that with a Nidoran. See what it gives me. Maybe. Futuna, come on. Stay with me, buddy. Stay with me. Yep. Yeah. Just stay with me. We'll be alright. We'll be alright. Maybe not. I did Okay, we are alright. We're good. We're good. We're good. Alright, if this Pokemon doesn't stay in the ball, it's gonna be very bad for Futuna. I probably should have gotten her out of here. But. Oh. Trust issues, man. Trust issues. That's wonderful. I love it. I'm sorry, Futuna. The ball shook three times. Should have stayed in, but it's my luck today. Nidosaur is super close to leveling up, by the way. Uh, I did forget about that, not gonna lie. Stay in the ball, trust issues, dude. Seriously, I'm gonna waste all my Pokeballs on a Spearow 100%. Waste all my Pokeballs on a Spearow. Why, why even bother if it doesn't stay in the ball this time? <sighs> That's it, Spiro. You asked for it. Bye. That Spiro asked for it. Broke out of the ball three times. Nope. Alright, well, that's it for this Petrograss. Time to heal up. Alright, we're healed up. I bought some more Pokeballs and some more DNA Splicers. So, time to get some more levels on our way to Mount Moon. Do you have some cool Pokemon to show me? Actually, um, I've got some weird Pokemon to show you. You got a regular- Oh look, a regular Metapod. Meet my Hatuna. Dude, the po- the, the trainers in this game have got to be like, what the hell is going on with all these weird ass fusions? Like, could you imagine just walking up to some- like, walking up to another trainer, wanting to battle, and then they threw out a Hutuna. Like, could you just, like, look at my team and then think of walking up to me and wanting to battle with a regular, like, Metapod or, like, a regular Pokemon. Really, bro? You want to rev your motorcycle? Anyway, before that guy so rudely interrupted me with revving his motorcycle, though I actually enjoyed that. But just imagine coming up to me, wanting to face me with a regular Pokemon, and then I threw out Hatuna or my Nidosaur or any or my Raki. Just just a man. Oh, look at that. Um, a Cataran. Speaking of weird Pokemon, yeah, gonna get uh Hatuna out of here. So I'm assuming this thing is a bug and poison type I'm a it's got Ekans' body so it's um it's got to be more Ekans than Caterpie I'm gonna test it okay so I think it's more bug than ow dude you just crit my Raggy dude what the that was so uncalled for That wasn't cool. Let me guess. It's gonna one shot my, my Nidoran? Oh no, Nidoran's okay. But does nothing. So Nidosaur, you're up. Um I wish I could have caught that Spiro just so I could have mixed it with Nidoran. I would love to see what it would look like. Not gonna lie. I should have gone for Peck. 
That would have been that would have been smarter. Cause that vine whip did nothing. Pep time. Yeah, come on, hit me with that poison sting. Does nothing. All right, so Cataranz is out. We got a Wii in. Okay, so let me guess. More again with the more bug than poison. I think that's I think that's what Ekans is is a poison type. Not quite sure. My hat doesn't want to stay nice on my head. It feels weird, and I don't know why. I, I don't know why today. All right, so we got the Wii ends out of here. So bring out that Metapod, dude. Bring out that Metapod. Hi, buddy. Long time no see. Hope you like a little, uh, little peck. Super effective. Did literally nothing because of the Harden. That's all Metapod is good for. I'm just kidding. Metapod is actually... I like Metapod, not gonna lie. But most of the time, if it only knows Harden, it's... It just... Just evolve it. Just, just evolve it. Although, how... I don't understand how you're gonna get experience points if you can't win the match for Metapod. Unless you do the swapping method that I do. Especially if your Metapod only knows Harden. At least get it to learn Tackle or something. Nidosaur is now level 13 and trying to learn poison powder. Um, mm, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of tackle because I've got peck. So, and trying to learn sleep powder. Oh, but I've already got the poison powder. Oh, we're not gonna learn. We're, we're not gonna learn sleep powder. Trying to learn poison sting. Bruh. Yeah, no, we're not gonna learn that either. That, I probably just messed up with the poison sting, but I do have the poison powder, so I mean... Ah, uh, well, there was no avoiding any of the battle. You looked at me, didn't you? No, you looked at me. I don't like the... F I, I don't like the way the sprites looked like they were kissing. It, it was... We it looked weird. We were, like, way too close. We were, like, nose to nose. Alright, so... She got a Spiro, which... I, I don't understand is faster. I mean, yeah, Hatuna is only level 8. My party, I should have ran back to the Pokemon Center before I did this. This was a bad idea on my part. 100% Fury Attack? Are you kidding me? Ow. Well, this is gonna, this is gonna end badly. Yep. I'm sorry, Nidosaur. Should have healed up. Alright, Nidoran. Go turn. I don't like how Nidoran has um the sprite of Nidosaur. I, I don't I don't know why. My game might be a little broken. I might have to see if there's like a patch for it. I'm not quite sure. I know this game is this game is pretty old, so Yeah. I'm gonna have to go on the, the site and check around just to see if there's any fixes. Alright, Nidoran, it's your turn. This is not cool. I am a horrible trainer right now. I am so bad. Um, God damn it, the Fury Attack. Ugh. I thought we missed the scratch, but it doesn't matter. We might as well have missed it. Might as well. Did nothing. That sweet. Go. Yep. All right, Natuna. All up to you. It's all up to you, girl. All up to you. This sucks. Can you like go for Peck or like Gus and not go for like Leer or something? I would love if we could get the poison off, but Fury Attack works. Oh, you only hit twice, Bruh. Seriously? Well, there's that pack that I asked for. I asked for it. Thanks, Janice. It was a great battle. I actually enjoyed it. Not really. Alright, back to the grindstone. I'm coming back, Janice, with a full healed up team. Oh, well, 
Avoid fights by not letting people see you. Well, that I couldn't I couldn't do anything about it there, uh, Calvin. A poly hoop. Bro, where can I get a polywag? I want one of those. I want a poly hoop. But I do kinda like my Hutuna, so uh, of course. Yep. Of course, perfect. They can automatically hit off a hypnosis, but when I go for it. I miss my attack. Like, can can somebody tell me why that happens? I hate the fact that the NPCs can always hit their always hit their attacks, but I can't. That did nothing. I want to get a leech seed off. Yeah, go for a bubble. That that's fine. It does nothing to. Yeah, see? Like, I can't get my leash seat. I couldn't get my leash seat off. Don't. And then, there's that. Cool. I love it when they can hit their attacks, but I can't hit mine. It's so great. I wish I could have avoided this guy, but this guy's probably going to end up taking me out. Thank you for missing that attack. You've already put my... You already put two of my Pokemon to sleep. Don't need another one. Yep. I'm having a great time. I'm just glad Raggy woke right up. I'm very happy with that. Uh, can we... Come on, Raggy. Thank you. That did... Dude, Raggy is doing nothing. Um... Yeah. Raggy's dead. Bye, Raggy. There's that motorcycle again. Um, Nidosaur, can you wake up? It'd be, it'd be great. It'd be helpful. It'd be wonderful. Just wake up, please. Wake up. Wake up to that water gun to the face. Come on. Yes. Take it out. Or don't. That works too. Uh, don't go for peck. Okay, water gun, that's fine. Fine. We're good. We're good. Take it out. Take it out. Thank you. Jeez. Uh, Hutuna is level 9 and trying to learn Peck, which I definitely want. Let's get rid of Let's get rid of Hypnosis. We don't need it because I miss it half the time anyway, so really makes no sense of having it. But um yeah, I'm gonna avoid Janice. I'm gonna avoid you two. I found a paralyzed heal. Sweet. Can I avoid you? I can. Sweet. Alright. Is there a Pokemon Center over here? Yeah. Alright. Oh, the Magic Carp seller's back in the Pokemon Center. For $500, you can get a Magic Carp, but I don't have $500. I have $280. Yeah. My. I am a poor. Hey, look, a Pidgey. I'm a poor boy. I am a poor boy. Uh, run. Okay. Don't want the Pidgey. I want to see if I can catch a Jigglypuff. Pretty sure I could find Jigglypuff in this patch of grass over here. Ooh, Sunkern. Ah. Oh, I didn't know Sunkern was going to be in here. Yes. Oh, I want it. I love Sunkern. If you can't tell by my voice, Sunkern is one of my favorites. I love its evolutionary line. Okay, come on. Come on, Sunkern. I want you on my team. I want you on my team. Come on. Uh, okay. I'm going to throw a Pokeball at it. Get in the ball. Please. Don't be like Spiro. You're going to be like Spiro. All right. I see how it is. See how it is there, Sunkern. All right. You want to play like that, huh? Probably should have kept Hypnosis. Probably could have gotten it off. Oh, and it goes for Absorb. Does nothing. Go. Cool. Good job. Um, can you get in the ball now? No. Pokeball. Get in there. Please. Please. 
Yeah, we got the sun current. Woo! Love it. All right. Um, I don't want to. I, I don't want to mix it with anything, but I'm kind of curious what happens when I do this. Sun current and Peter in. Oh, oh no. All right. What about this? Oh, jeez. I want to do it. I, as much as I love Sunkern, I, I know I, I'm just going to do it. We're doing it. Using Niran and Sunkern. What do we got? What do we got? Roll the dice. I am concerned about this fusion. <laughs> I am highly concerned. We got a Sunran. Oh, jeez. Sunran try to minimize movement to conserve the nutrients they have stored in their bodies for evolution. When enraged, it releases a horrible something. <laughs> oh, we're learning tail whip. Grass whistle? Ooh, uh, solar power. Okay, so let's get rid of tail whip. I don't know what grass whistle does. We're not learning growth. Yes. Uh, ingrain, I think that does, um, yeah, it lays roots. That's what I thought it was. We're gonna get rid of growl. Okay, I need to see what, uh, oh, I don't want to fuse. I need to see what grass whistle does. Let's see what that does. Sunran, summary, moves, grass whistle. The user plays a pleasant melody that lulls the target to these three. Oh, so it's one, okay, so it's that. All right, all right. I am still highly concerned with that fusion. Oh, look, another Sunkern. I want to catch it, but on the other hand, can't escape anyway, so that's great. Wonderful. Um, yeah, got away. See what else I can find. I want to find a Jigglypuff. Dude, can you, like, leave me alone, Sunkern? I get it. You guys like me. I like you too. But Jigglypuff, where are you at? Another Pidgey. Well, I don't think I'm gonna find a Jigglypuff. So I think can't escape anyway. That's great. Um, I'm gonna definitely do some off-screen training. I'm gonna take on the rest of these uh, trainers off-screen. And uh, actually, you know what? I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do it right now. The look you keep. So intriguing. Oh, yeah? Is it now? Is it now, Robin? We got a pink a puff. Pink a puff! I want. I want it. Oh my god. See, this is why I need a Pikachu and a Jigglypuff. This was. This is the one thing I was thinking of when, when I first started playing this game. Like, what happens if you fuse a Pikachu and a Jigglypuff? And now I've got my answer. I love it. I want it. Robin, I'll trade you. I, I mean, I love my Hatuna, but I'll trade you my Hatuna for your, uh, your Pika Puff. <laughs> 100%. We're gonna, we're gonna break through the Paralyze anyway, and then just shed it, you know? Oh, wait, we're not gonna, oh, we did. No, we didn't. I thought we did. Never mind. So, we're just gonna break through it, which is good. Can we shed it? No. We're not. What happened the first time? Alright, Rat Gee, you're up. You're probably gonna go down to one Thunder Shock. If it goes for it. Thunder Wave. It's fine. Whatever. At least it didn't go for Thunder Shock. We're gonna hit a Gust, see what that does. We're already paralyzed, it doesn't matter. That does nothing. That answers my question. And now we're hit with the paralyzed. Yep. Cool. Uh, thank you for punching me. That was fantastic. It felt great. We got rid of the Pika Puff. I want it so bad. Reggie is level 10 and trying to learn Bite. I'll take it. Take it over Focus Energy. I don't use Focus Energy anyway, so... Ooh, so close to leveling up. All right, all right. Um, quick heal, and then we'll take on the last two gym. Yeah, last two gyms. Yeah. 
Okay. Fully healed. Ready to take on the last two trainers on this route. And then I will end the episode there. Catching Pokemon? I just can't get enough. I know, right? I feel you. I feel you with that one there, uh, Greg. Scatterpee. Alright. Alright. Starting off with a regular Pokemon. <laughs> As I start off with a mix. Yeah. I love my fusion. I really do. We just destroyed that Caterpie. Damn. Okay, Hatuna. Level 10. Alright. A, a spear piece. Oh my god. Um. Yeah, and they got a crit. It's fantastic. Alright. Um. Please don't get another crit. Oh, cool. You didn't get another crit. Alright, so. Now we know what it ha what happens when you play some Spearow and a Caterpie, uh, Spearow. Oh my god, what is up with it, uh, Hatuna? I'm so sorry, girl. I'm so sorry. Okay, never mind. We're good. We're good. Whew. All right, I'm gonna get Hatuna out of here before she uh, before she goes down. Racky, it's your turn. Um, I'm gonna try to do some more. Pokemon catching off screen as well. Just to see if I can find my Jigglypuff. Uh, yeah. But I'll probably put it at the end of this video. Or at the beginning of next video. Or like I did in at the beginning of this video. Where I put in my tra my little training thing. So, yeah. It'll either be at the end of this one. Or at in the next one. Can we, like, get this beard all out of here? Finish it off, Raggy. Just take it. Ow. This thing looks mad as hell. Racky is now level 11. And we defeated Greg. Oh no. Alright, so all we got left to do. Oh, Hoodle. Hutuna is already evolving. Two evolutions. Right off the bat. So I am scared to see what this beat girl looks like. Um. Yeah, uh, we got a hoot drill now. Uh, this is concerning. <laughs> um, all right, we're gonna get rid of string shot for fury attack. All right, so one more trainer to go. Actually, there's two more trainers to go, but I'm actually going to end this episode here. Uh, I've already had enough weird that I can handle so I hope you guys enjoyed the weirdness and the weird fusions that we did and the two evolutions that I got I'm still concerned about that hoot drill but hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next Pokemon video